Hi, my name is Jadis Annika, and welcome back to my playthrough of Whistleblower from Outlast. In the last episode, um, there was a man with a handsaw, and we ran away from him. We had to get a key, and all shit went down. Um, slightly confused but they all look like they've been starved for years and, I, and I'm, I'm, I'm confused about a couple of things honestly one of the things I'm confused about is that the original file said that she went down in um, the 1930s or the 40s or whatever that Wernicke was from World War II but the morphogenic engine is obviously not from World War II Okay, so give me some place to hide. Why? Can I push this? No. I'm wasting battery. Can I open this? No. Batteries. No batteries for me. There's a note. Can I clicky? No. Um. Serve my place now? Um, does there happen to possibly be a weapon of some kind in here? That would be most useful at this particular moment in time. Doesn't seem to really be anything in here. What is this? Well, technically, if I've got bleach, and I've got soap, and I've obviously got combustibles, um, I could make a weapon. Can I go up that way? No. There's a stair going up there. Door there. So I guess I'll see where the stairs go. It's a dead person now. Pipes.
exit, please? No. Chapel? File. all that's in here. And there's no way out above. Hmm. I would like to read the journal entry when I know I'm safe. Thank you very much. Is there a door here? Lockers to hide. And can that guy get me? This looks like the sink that Traeger cut my other person's fingers off. Jack! I don't remember his name, I'm just gonna call him Jack. Everyone's Jack. Everyone who I play is Jack. Everyone who dies is Bob. So there's nothing really in here. So they can't go back that way. Maybe I'll go back up here. I think I'm relatively safe up here anyway, so. God and family. Father Clark. Far be it from me to lie to a man of God, so let me at least say that I will do my personal best to improve the safety of your working conditions. I and the rest of the staff truly appreciate everything you do for our patients. And if you feel threatened by anybody in particular, simply let us know and we can either increase chemical restraints or administer a lobotomy or a similar <laughs> calming procedure. Okay. Don't underestimate the contribution your sermons offer our patients. Especially considering the depth of and necessity necessarily chaotic nature of hypnotherapy. Our patients need the bedrocks of God and family. Not all of our poor unfortunates have families to call upon, and so the burden and calling is yours. We are all of us relying on your faith and hard work. DBNR, I don't know what that means. Dr. Newhouse, MD. 1961. See, yeah. Oh, Dr. Bruce Newhouse. But this is 1961. Tambourine Man. There should be a um, superhero called Tambourine Man. Um, can I jump up here? I'm clicking, but oh, I have to jump. Okay. This is the only way out. Ooh, it's a smokestack. Oh, wait, dirt would be a smokestack, wouldn't it? Because, um, it's the crematorium. So, of course, it would be a smokestack. I have to. What was this called? I'd be freaking too. Especially if I was seeing the wall rider. Can I go through here? No. I must have been in the morphogenic engine for a long time. Why is there a mattress in here? That's kind of weird. Freedom. Um. By the way, that reminds me so much of Portal. Just saying.
Or Portal 2, I should say. I have a shadow. Look at my pretty shadow. Um, is this door locked, or...? I can't click on it at all. I'm pointing right at this door and I can't click on it at all. And there's a battery right there. But it's a scary. But I know there is a battery for me. Yeah, it's his head. It's a place to hide. Do I need a place to hide? Um. Okay, that's where I came from. This is actually a very peculiar space. Is this space here just simply for the maintenance of the smokestack? I mean, why the lockers? Seems kind of odd. Just saying. My person whimpers a lot like Jack from the first episode of the first game. Name's Jack too. Can't go that way. I thought for sure I was gonna turn around and there was gonna be a naughty bad. There's no place to hide. Oh, was the game just letting me know he was there or Be out almost too. How do I? Um, there doesn't seem to be any place to go in this room. My battery's gonna come back, and he's gonna be there. Mr. Screwy, is he gonna find me in here? <laughs> that was funny. I completely just like hit, even though he can see me. Um, I don't know where to go. I, I don't know where I'm going. I think this is backtracking. Ah! Ah! No! 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 Ow! Just leave me alone. Nobody likes you. Oh man, I died. I guess he's gonna eat tonight. Mm -mm, tasty. Mr. Crazy Man's gonna eat good tonight. Well, I guess we know what happens when he catches us. No, 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 ow. No, no, ow, no, ow, no, ow, no. I don't know where. I don't know where I'm going. Um, can you still see me? I don't know. I don't really know. He can still see me. Can he? He can. And I, I let him on a merry chase now, and I can go find my way. Because apparently I can run faster than him, even when I'm wounded. So that's good. I know. 
shut the door in his face. Haha. Um, this is the way I had gone. Um, so this way? Yeah. This way. Probably missing a bunch of stuff. But I'm not really sure I care. Yes, I do. Flash, I'll waste an entire battery looking for crap that I don't really need. Because there's probably nothing I missed. Or if there is anything I missed, it's probably one battery. Which is completely useless. Waste of my time. But we'll see. If he's still around. I don't know. I don't really know. Okay, that was the library. It's locked. Did I search the library? I think I did. Yeah. And I I didn't get a chance to search this room. But it doesn't look like there's really anything in it anyway. So yeah, whatever. I didn't miss anything, I guess. This way? No. I don't know. It's kind of odd. Saving. Yay for saving. Not. Naughty bad man's probably going to be out here. Saw man. These batteries certainly wear out fast. Or maybe it's just me because I suck. Or I have a crutch. I have a crutching. I have a, a need to have batteries. Oh. <sighs> Find the main valve and shut off the gas to the airlock. Um. Not over here, obviously. Can you go before that person dies? Um. Well, that's a battery. I don't think it's the way to shut off the gas. Um. I can't go that way. I can't go that way. Is this the valve that I need? No. Um, sorry mister, but I'm sure you're already dead. There's a window there, but... I guess I have to go this way? There's a file there. But I don't think that's the... Maybe it's the way to shut off the valves. I don't know. No. I will read that in a second. Okay, so... Am I just going to ignore that man? his own head. So, you know. Um, have good fun with that. Is this the main valve? No. E-237. I'm looking for the valve to shut off the gas, but 
I get the impression that it's not distraction. I mean, I don't see how it really could be. There's got to be some way to turn off the gas. That I'm overlooking. Is it where you're trying to... have to go back? <laughs> Shut off the main valve. Can I jump up? No. Sorry, guy. You're probably dead. I just don't understand what they're asking of me. So I can't go that way. This room wasn't open before. Hmm. Is this man dead? Yeah, I would guess so. It's not hung over. Okay, so... I can't go that... Well, I can go that way, but there weren't any valves over there. And I can't... I don't know, mister. I'm sorry, but... Um, it's not really what I intended to do. There were valves all the way back at the other thing. <sighs> Can I jump up here? No. I don't know what to tell you, mister. Because I don't seem to have any way of turning off the main valve. So... Have a nice life, I guess. Or death. As it may be. Because I've wasted enough battery on looking for the main valve. I don't know. What did I say it was? Was it in here? No. Um. Was it in here? That I saw the number is 237? I'm pretty sure it was 237. Whatever, I guess I'll read the journal entry after all. Influencing human behavior. The, the potential use of, psycho of psychochemicals in political action operations is well recognized. Although it has, been, has not been explored as thoroughly as might be expected, chemical division includes it as an objective of its program to be prepared to support or make such operations possible. Non-chemical methods of accomplishing political action operations are also included in the program. They talk about Agent Orange or something? Present the above Maltraca extra. I, I, I can't imagine how to pronounce MK together. So I'm just gonna Maltra, I guess. Um, excerpt to Technical Services Division for budgeting and authorization of continued research into research of Dr. Rudolf Wernicke and Project Wellrider. Autopsy of recovered test subject shows chemical content of bodies, metallic tumors, evidence of a subdermal combustion that indicates heavy psychochemical dosage. Okay. Metallic tumors, okay, whatever, but subdermal combustion? 
why didn't they spontaneously combust then? I don't, I don't understand. Is that what the explosion? Is that why everybody looks like that? What's his face? Um, who has the all the people who have the messed up faces? Okay, so this is where I saw that. Why is there a place to hide? Two, three, seven. Okay, yeah. I'm sorry, mister, but I don't know where the shutoff is. So. Nurses station. Are the nurses from... Yeah, no. Can you hop over that? Shit, you can. Oh, get in there. <laughs> oh, I don't like that guy. Oh, I don't like that guy. I don't like him. Okay, so I just went across a, a, a different room, that's all. Um, how is that helpful? I don't actually see how it is helpful. Is he still in there? I don't know, his music went away, so... Maybe? I don't know. Wouldn't he be just... Right along here anyway? Can you make a move, please? Can we hide? That door looks like it's blocked. Is he gonna come in here? about what I'm supposed to be doing. It's run music. I don't know. I don't know, it's run music. Twenty-seven. Two twenty-nine. 
So they're going up. So it has to be this direction I'm supposed to go. Okay. Two thirty-four. Oh, there's more than one room doing that thing. Is this the room I was in before? No. But I can't hide in here. Oh, yes I can. There are all these vents. I'm losing my batteries a lot. So I need to go this way. 237. That was the room I wanted, it was 237, wasn't it? <laughs> break the door down. I'm confused. Um, okay, crack in the wall. That leads to a bathroom. It's kind of weird. Dude, with the thingy gonna be right out here. I don't know. I could really use some batteries, but I don't think I'm gonna find any. Because why would there be batteries in any of these rooms? this stuff when I played the other play the other was the original yeah I'm gonna wait until there's a locker to hide in or something thanks anyway oh there's a locker okay good project wall rider patient status report for Frank Manera initial date of patient consult Patient age 36, male. Therapy status. Minimal, minimal morphogenic engine activity and only at extreme stages 5 and 6 levels of hormone therapy. Dream states return repeatedly to images of isolation and betrayal. Zero lucid state. Diagnosis. Heavy bronchial accumulation consistent with patients with histories of tobacco and marijuana. Exceptionally low REM activity. At the time of this interview, Frank was down to 155 pounds from his admission weight of 228. He was lethargic and largely non-responsive, exhibiting interest only in the hypnotherapy script pattern 9, Wernicke, con concerning drinking blood from the chest of a sleeping man. Okay. He continues to refuse baths or the attention of the barber outside of general anesthesia, stating, If I cannot partake, I cannot share. Okay. Recommend forced nutrition for Mr. Manera if we cannot find something he likes to eat. So, is the chainsaw man Mr. Manera? So, that's Frank chasing me? Oh my god. I saw those red flashing lights out there and I thought it was him right outside the locker. I was like, oh, no, Mr. Chambery man, you lied to me. Um, there's an awful lot of locked doors in this building. Go away! This is my place. Um, sorry, but... You gotta get me killed! Fuck off! 
you're, you're gonna die anyway, mister. Sorry. Patrick! Um. So what am I supposed to do in here? Okay. There's nobody even in there. Gas room. Shut the door. Did he go? Where is he? Is he out here? Or is he in there? Can't really tell. But apparently, he's kind enough to rev his. Um, Chainsaw or whatever. Boy, this just reminds me of alien isolation. Not make them in this room. But he'll never know that I'm in here, right? Why do they cover the plastic? So there's only one door in and out.
point of coming in here? How is he not going to see me under this bed? How is he not going to know where I am? when I come out to play, then he won't know where I am. And I don't know where I'm supposed to go. Is he in there? I don't know where he is. Down here. Rick. So I can turn off the gas for him. Use shortwave radio in the prison. Um. Um. I assume I don't go back the way I came. I hope. Shit, I do. Really? Maybe. Is it the bad man going to do? Off. Isn't the bad man going to be down here? Um, I, I'm, 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 I don't, I don't, I don't want to be here. I don't, I don't want to be here. I really don't want to be here. So, where am I supposed to go from here? Is he going any farther? No, he's not. He's going that way. I don't know. Where's he gonna go? Totally alien resurrection is. I have to go back through the bathroom? Is he coming to find me? I don't know. He's 
seems awfully close. Is he guarding that? It's over here. No, 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 please don't be a. Oh man, shit. Oh wait, wait, wait no, okay. <laughs> Thought it was a dead end again. Oh, right, because I turned off the gas. Hi, is your name Frank? I think your name is Frank. You're one screwy person, Frank. I guess you're wearing pants, though, at least. It's not what I meant, why I did that, though. I was trying to look at his tattoo. It's an eagle. Hmm. You're a very strange man. Sorry, why don't you go much on someone else? Whack job. Oh wait, let me guess. He's in there now since I left. He can go in. So he can follow me? That's spiffy. Um, I can't go that way? No. Oh, this is where I was before. The guy. Okay. So, should I go in here? Yeah, he died anyway. Well, um... I think I'm gonna end the episode here. Because, um, this is a new area. I think it's outside, actually. But, um, if you liked it, please hit like and subscribe. And don't forget to ring my bell. Bye!